Hello Aquarius, welcome back. Real quick, for those of you that are new, I don't do date and time specific, okay? It's a general reading. If it resonates for you, awesome. If it doesn't, check the other signs in your chart, watch one of those videos, or you can book a personal reading with me. Link to my website is in the description box below, okay? And feel free, I would encourage you to check back on previous videos. Sometimes I'm a little bit ahead of you guys, so something I said a couple months ago could be relevant now. Well, getting right into it, the spirit animal that you're coming up as, I'm feeling very in my head and I'm feeling a little spaced out. So I don't know if some of you Aquarians have been feeling like overtired or something about the, the mind seems relevant, like you're unable to focus on thoughts or something along these lines. But anyway, you are the orange blossom jellyfish. Okay, so I think you're just kind of floating along. You could, water could be relevant to you in some sort of way. Or again, this could just have to do with the realm of emotions. I don't feel like, if so, you don't feel very in touch. I feel like you're just sort of floating along, going with the flow. And I don't really think that you care much. I'm just getting that feeling like you're, you're fine, but you don't really care. I don't know. It's kind of a weird vibe I'm getting right now. And who you're dealing with is the wild horse. So you could be dealing with somebody who is kind of likes to be alone and impossible to control. This person is a little bit unpredictable in their nature and they kind of come and go as they please or that's what they like to do. They could have a significant marking or a tattoo or something along these lines. But again, and this individual is very creative and I feel like they may be a little bit temperamental as well, but I'm feeling as if you sort of don't care. You know what I mean? I think for the most part, you just kind of steer clear of this person's cycles and whatever they do because, you know, they have a good nature to them there could be something significant about their hair. They could have kind of wild hair as well. I see just hair all over the place. But it looks it looks good. Like this person's attractive and appealing. You know, they present a, a good image, but they're just very hard to control. Like they don't like to follow along with the rules. There could be something that's slowly deteriorating in this relationship with this person, if it's personal business you know, whatever. I'm just feeling like it's not what it was and it's just kind of crumbling. It's, something's eating away at it or eating away at somebody. I'm getting that very strong. There could be some new information revealed to you about something that you've been waiting on. This could have to do with stability or abundance, money, you won't have to wait. If you've been waiting for money, you won't have to wait much longer. I am also picking up on that, that somebody could decide not to wait on you any longer as well. Um, I don't feel like they will leave you or anything like this, but I think they're done focusing on it as much. Somebody is holding back. They're holding back either their true feelings or not really opening up and this seems in regards to some sort of foundation family or commitment there's and when the other person tries to get this individual to open up they're met with a lot of defensiveness it's like whoever is the defensive one is not willing to compromise they're not willing to yield it's just like no you know again this wild horse i feel like Yeah, there's just a lot that's being, you know, closed off. I'm just getting very closed off energy, not putting a lot of work into love. I'm seeing this love potential here, but it's almost like, I feel like it might be you, Aquarius, that you're just focusing on a lot of different things and love isn't one of them that you're interested in, you know? Out of all the options and the 
several plates. It's like you've got several dinners in front of you and you know, you're like, okay, I have to focus on all of this and then I have to do the clean up and you know, it's 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 just to me like you don't you have your back turn towards love so even though somebody is trying to offer their love to you but I don't think Aquarius cares you know but I do feel like you're kind of I feel like you're focused on satisfying yourself and what makes you happy what you want to do you're done doing what others want to do you want to do what you want to do uh, and this could be in regards to a family dynamic too. You could be dealing with a water sign, but it doesn't have to be. There could also be somebody else involved. Or, or, Aquarius, there could be somebody on your mind that you want. This person, but you don't speak to them. or they're not speaking to you or something like that, but they're like, because there's no movement here, but there's something very mysterious about this individual. However, if, if you are thinking about somebody, you're totally in your head about it and you're not gonna do anything. <laughs> or this individual. For some of you, there could have been like somebody that you interacted with. It could have been a betrayal if you were in a relationship and this woman is mysterious and watery and you still think about like thinking about your interaction with this woman or man um, makes you happy, but you're just, you just keep it in your head. You just keep it to yourself. It ended. It's like, and it wasn't meant to go any farther than that. That won't resonate for everybody, but <laughs> for some of you may have had some sort of romantic connection that was like a wish fulfillment but it couldn't go any farther for some reason let's see um i see a lot of defensiveness i see a, there's like mental conflict going on here something is like going on underneath the surface with you or somebody else but i'm seeing like holding a lot of stuff in not letting go and really just It's like something needs to end, but you're very trapped in your mind over it, or this person is. I'm getting, I'm getting, and so this is very specific for somebody, but there's a lot of you had like a sexual encounter with somebody, and I feel like it's a water sign. Could be a Piscean, but like there's a lot of water or potentially air as well. but. You know, and I don't know if this is just on your mind and you're just thinking, because I don't see you pursuing this. I see you just thinking about, it's like somebody snuck off and did something or like secretly is fantasizing about a water sign. I'm getting that. <laughs> I don't know, I'm getting that <laughs> very strong, but I know that's specific. You know, this water sign could be this person that's not attainable, that's kind of non-committal, even not a good attention span either. There's just, I don't know. But there's like this sexual tension lingering in the air, but it's, you're not going towards it. You're just thinking about it and thinking about how you want it. Or this is somebody about you. I don't know, but whew, it's getting a little bit. It's like somebody's not moving towards something they want because they don't want to be betray somebody else or do something in secret or deceitful. It's like that type of dynamic. But if you're in a foundation, it's like it's not good anymore. So whatever this is that you had, I mean, this... It's coming across very feminine to me, but it could be male or female. But look at how tempting she is. She's just so mystical and feminine. And this is, you know, this is who you're thinking about. Or who, you know, who's thinking about you. But I think you're thinking about this person. 
and you've probably already had a sexual encounter with them or if not you've dreamt of it but anyway so okay uh one last thing if you feel like this person that you want because there's no movement it there isn't potential that's not true that's just for some of you okay you know like if that doesn't resonate at all then but it's like there's somebody you're not paying attention to because you don't think it's attainable that's not true so i'm gonna end with that all right aquarius bye-bye